up team, took the day off yesterday. All we did was drive back from Zion up to Salt Lake City and just kind of wanted to spend some time with my mom. So this morning I dropped my mom off at the airport and then I got some work done, then had a great meeting with Creighton. Creighton, you remember him a couple weeks ago. We have got some awesome travel plans coming up in the next month. Now I'm driving over to hang out with the C. Taller family. You remember them from Delicate Arch? Was texting with Jake and was just, hey, you guys want to hang out? I'm in Salt Lake. And he was like, yeah, you want to do a van challenge? And I'm like, yeah, let's do a van challenge. Not a clue what we're going to be doing here, but I don't know. You know, that's that's the fun. We're going to go figure this out. Just Yo, how's it going? Yeah. What's up, dude? Good, Good to see you. In. Good to see you, man. Ugh. Uh, how you been? Doing well. How are good. you guys? Come on in. I'm good. I'm good to just slide down this. You're good. Okay. Don't let go. Ah, oh, crap. All right. Well, let's we'll see you at the bottom. You've got a fireman's pole in here, and then Lincoln, why don't, can you show me? Why do you? Is this your favorite swing? Yeah. Oh man. Does your dad ever swing on it? Uh, Not often. No. He might hit his head up there, right? <laughs> Gosh. This is this is like a dream almost. You got. Got the swing right there. Got the pro set up here. Man. First shot of Battle of the Vans. Gotta get the opening shot. And we're in some part of Utah, which I don't even know where we are, but it's a cool little small town. The main video that we're shooting is going on the Sea Tallers channel. I'm just doing behind the scenes kind of stuff for the vlog. So if you want to actually see this real video, you should go, just go follow their channel. I'll make sure they're all linked in the description below so you can go follow them and then see who wins this whole challenge. You've seen the pics, the videos, the glory called van life. You've even seen us, the Sea Tallers, cruising around in our ice cream truck, living the van life, the whole time van life. And we thought, what better way to learn about van life than to bring him out here for a battle of the vans? I'm Jake Seataller and this is my van. A 1978 Volkswagen Transporter we call just the Transporter. It has 19,000 miles because the odometer flips over at 100,000. Good enough? You didn't say miles per gallon. You I know we're filming the intros saying. right oh, now. Okay. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm supposed to do now. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh, that's a good sh Ooh, that's my new shot. Cool. <laughs> my name's Justin Fricky, and this is my 2008 Ford Econoline 150. I like to call her Fiona Van Gogh. She's got over 130,000 miles on her, and she's great for slumber parties because she sleeps 10. Bing. Yes, got it. <laughs> she doesn't really sleep 10, she only sleeps one. Is this our finish line? Yeah. I like the bottle of oil as <laughs> part of the finish line too. Okay boys, sometimes on the van life, your van breaks down and you gotta pull it to the finish line. <laughs> Let's see if you can do it or something. Fiona doesn't break down. Knock on wood. Gosh, Fiona doesn't. Fiona doesn't break down. <laughs> I'm the pit crew, and I'm gonna hook this onto the bus. I don't think it's gonna break. Got one in. Gotta get the other. Okay. Going back out. <laughs> We're trying to film this next bit on a residential street, but cars kind of keep on keep on going by. So you know, you gotta, you gotta just go with it and see what happens. You know, I'm not feel like there's like pressure on the bumper or anything. It feels really soft. Yeah, I'm not worried about it. Can I be under the car? So what are you can get onto? Oh, right there, right onto the frame. We have your we have your approval, Lincoln. <laughs> Good news, guys. We have we have Lincoln's approval. Good. All right, thanks, Lincoln. Okay, filming one more. Justin? Oh yeah, totally. I can't believe I pulled that. That was funny. He just started going off track because 
Well, I don't know why, but it was pretty funny. He was supposed to go straight all the way over my shoulder, but then Jake ended up going off to the side. Makes it easier for me to maybe win. Oh, car. That's cool. I don't think they're too happy this time. What on earth are you? Are you antelope? I don't know what you are, but you look really cool. Run, whoa, you run so cool. Bye. See you later. I have no idea what those animals were, but they looked so cool. If I had to put money on it, I would say antelope, but I'm not 100% sure. But I think that was my first time seeing an antelope in the wild. Man, they ran so cool. Like, way, way cooler than deer. We're trying to film the last segment. It's one of the toughest because we're trying to make it look like we're drag racing. Gotcha, perfect. We just got done with the video and you've seen this van around for a little while now, but you haven't actually seen the inside. So let's go take a look inside the Sea Taller's van. I'm Captain Jake of the Ice Cream Pirates and this is the Transporter, our 1978 Volkswagen bus that we use to cruise the concrete seas. Let's take a look at the ice cream truck. Purple carpets, pink seats, and don't forget an endless supply of delicious ice cream. And no ice cream truck would be complete without some rad tunes. That is all the behind the scenes. And seriously, how awesome is this ice cream bus ship, whatever it is. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe to the Sea Taller's uh, YouTube channel. I've got a link in the description below. And I'm also going to have some other links popping up around here too. But Jake, can you tell us what exactly you guys do with this awesome bus that this you have? This is the transporter, man. It's not just a bus. It's an ice cream truck and it's our van for our van life. So you watch our family go out on family adventures, family adventure vlog, giving out free ice cream and sailing the concrete seas, having fun. Seriously, go subscribe to their channel. And if you see the, if you see the ice cream pirates, transporter ship i still don't know the right way to call it <laughs> you see it driving around anywhere wave them down they might have some ice cream to give out that's but right until then see you later